This is a simple compact backswing. However, every typical or traditional golf swing unknowingly places some joints into positions at the top which make for unnecessary or awkward downswing motion. Here those positions are the drop in the left knee, hip and shoulder and the internal rotation of the right shoulder which can be recognized by the right elbow pointing backwards. Now this golfer will have to drop the right side down as he tries to rotate his trunk for power and will have to try to drop the right shoulder back so the club can arrive from the inside. With age, so many extra moves become too much and the golfer's brain simply directs some other compensating move instead. From this angle too, the laterally flexed left hip, shoulder and knee are clearly seen as is the internally rotated right shoulder. This downswing only manages some of the undoing movements required. It drops the right side down and rotates the hips slightly. There is no time to drop the shoulder backwards. In fact, the shoulder arrives at the ball in a very protracted or sticking out forwards manner. The result? The right elbow has to straighten in an awkward direction so that impact is more of a scoop than a compression.